what? That ACC does not care. Look at there. That ACC don't care. Guys, that's 25. That's a one man limit right there. That is 25 fish. Man. How fun is that? How fun is that, guys? I'm out here in the little John boat, no electronics. Guys, you can do this too, all right? If I can do it, then you can do it too as well. You don't need all the fancy equipment to catch fish. I'm telling you, I show y'all that on a regular basis on this channel. What's going on YouTube? This is 903 Fishing. Guys, I'm gonna be crappie fishing in a small river today. Hopefully some of these crappie have moved in here to spawn. I'm gonna be trying to find structure in about three to five feet of water and hopefully these crappie are there it should be a good time today i appreciate y'all for watching on a serious note guys i just found out i lost my uncle all right i've lost my grandparents on my mama's side and my uncle uh within the past year and a half or so so y'all be sure to tell your loved ones that you love them all right because when god calls he's gonna call and it could be within a blink of an eye so I just wanted to throw that out there. Y'all already know I got the eight foot ACC crappie sticks with me today. I have them rigged up for slip corks, but I also have my 10 and 11 foot ACC just in case I find some structure close to the bank and I need to be able to reach out to those crappie and try to poke them up out of some timber. I'm gonna try to get on these crappie. If you haven't hit that like button, go ahead and hit it. I greatly appreciate it. Also, if you're subscribed to the channel, god bless you y'all know i would not be doing this without you guys if you haven't hit that subscribe button and you love you some crappie fishing whether it be from a john boat the bank or a kayak this is the channel for you go ahead and hit that subscribe button i'd greatly appreciate it y'all be sure to stick around let's get on these crappie there he is there he is oh man that's a good one. Oh wow Look at that crappie right there, guys. That's a decent fish. I'm telling you, these small little log jams like this, currents flowing this way, these logs are just trapped against this railroad trussle and they can't get out, but these crappie love it. Structure, it's about three to four foot deep and they like it. Let's see if there's another one real quick. I'm just picking and poking in here. Sometimes I'll go right in the middle of it, then sometimes I'll just go right on the edges of it, see if I can't get them to come out and chase this jig. It's really, it really just depends on how I'm feeling at the time. There he is, there he is, look at there. Oh my gosh. Oh, that's a good fish. Man. Oh, that's a good one, guys. Wowza. All right, guys, that was the longest train I've ever witnessed go by in my life. But you know what? Right now, I'm using Gray Ghost from Dead River Baits right here, guys. Gray Ghost from Dead River Baits. If I could get my pole out of the way. one eighth ounce jig head, all right? I tried using a 16th, but the current and the wind is allowing that jig head to move around with that 1 16th. So I went ahead and went back to the 1 8th. It's a little heavier. It's gonna keep that jig vertical for me. So let's see if we can't go get another one. I'm gonna go right back in that same hole that I just caught that one at. Oh, there it is. Get out of there. Look at that ACC, guys. That is a toad. That is a freaking toad. Hold on, hold on. Let me get some line out on him. Don't come off, baby. What are you doing, Belle? That is a freaking toad. Oh, man. Guys, look at that fish. Wowza. Oh, man. What a fish. That's probably a pound and a half or so. Pound and a half. That's a good fish, guys. Oh, man let's get it let's go putting some toads in that cooler guys i am using the head mount all right i'm getting a little more comfortable with it just kind of using that trolling motor to 
back me off a little bit or to, to push me back towards the wind is blowing right in my direction and the anchor just ain't holding like I want it to really there he is get out of there nice oh come here fish see that the thing is i'm fishing with this 11 foot acc so i can reach but at the same time if i only have you know three or four foot of line out it's going to be really difficult to flip that crappie to me so that's why sometimes you see me letting out the line so i can have enough line to flip that crappie in there he is guys got that one in the gills but you know what i'm grocery fishing today and now this is a pretty fish, a real pretty fish. A little female, it looks like. She gonna go in the cooler. Let's see if we can't get another one. Let's see what we can do. Now, I didn't reel that one. I just held it up. Let's see what happens. Oh my gosh, another one. And it's a good one. Look at there. Look at that, guys. Oh my gosh, check out that fish. That is a beautiful crappie. That didn't take long, did it? That was back-to-back -back drops in the same spot. I'm about to go right back to that spot. Guys, I did bring minnows today, but I haven't used them, okay? I have not used the minnows. Um, I'll, I'll, I will use anything I have to use to put fish in the boat, period, and I don't care what nobody says. If it's putting fish in the boat, that's all that matters to me. So I will use minnows if necessary. If I don't have to use them, I won't use them. But you know what? These jigs from Dead River Baits are working right now. We're gonna keep on rolling with it. There he is. There's another one. They're in there. Don't fling that jig off, boy. Actually, girl, there he is. See, that's what I'm saying, guys. I only have about three three foot of line out. It's hard to flip that crappie to you fishing with an 11 foot pole, but you know what? We're gonna get the job done one way or another. That's another nice fish, guys. See, this is the type of fishing right here. You don't need electronics. I'm not using electronics. I don't even have my fish finder hooked up. I am just strictly going off of what I know. And I'm not going to lie, guys. This wind is really tough right now. It is blowing straight at me. I'm having, I'll catch one fish and I'm having to reposition myself again and again. I thought the wind would calm down as the day went, but was I totally wrong? There he is get out of there oh come on he's right there come on fish did he get off no he got it there there it is oh look at that oh my gosh guys this is awesome right here this is freaking awesome man i hope y'all are enjoying this video as much as i am right now as much as I am making it. I mean, look at that stud. That is a pretty white crappie. All white crappie so far, no black crappie, all white. I think I got the boat now to stay where I want it. Check that out. I don't know if y'all can see that because of the head mount, but I'm not moving. So I'm gonna fish this area until these stop biting. If I don't get a bite 15, 20 minutes, then I'll scoot over and fish another portion. But we're just going to keep rolling with what we're doing right here, guys. Look at that. Pretty fish. I'm going to go in here. I haven't went in here yet. There's got to be a fish in there. Look at there. There's got... Oh, my gosh, guys. Oh, my gosh. I said there's got to be a fish in there. I have not went in that little crack. <laughs> that is freaking awesome. Oh, my gosh. Oh my gosh, I, 
I said there's got to be a fish in there. Look at that fish. Wowza. Gosh, I hope these angles are good for you guys. Look at the back, guys. That is some that is a meaty fish right there. Let's go. Oh, by the way, I have changed to let me show y'all real quick. This is one of Dead River Bait's new jigs, guys. Look at that. Monkey milk, monkey milk body, chartreuse tail. I've switched over. Uh, they're killing it right now. They're murdering it. Let's see if there's another one in there. Where you at, fish? Is there one on this side? Oh my gosh, there he is. Oh, not as big, but he's there. You know what, guys? I'm gonna let this one go. That's probably 10 inches, but I'm gonna let that one go. Let's see if there's another one. These logs are so thick, guys. I mean, I think there's three times as many logs under the water that you can't see because i'm just oh my gosh that's not a crappie is that a crappie that is a crappie holy smokes guys that sucker hit it like a bass i think there's so many logs under there that you just can't see guys look nope oh my god look at the catch look at the hands look at the hands but Bo boom oh that's a pretty fish guys man i hope y'all are catching all this let's get it let's go oh my gosh another one right guys i just caught that one and i dropped it back down and boom Oh, that monkey milk and chartreuse from Dead River Baits is doing some work, guys. Work. Oh, man, what a fish. What a fish. Let's see if we can't drop down and do it again. Let me fix this jig. Guys, I'm fishing about three foot deep. That's it. About, th well, two to three foot. See, they, they could be all the way on this stick right here. They could be. Let me see. That's got to go in the water somewhere down there. There he is! Look at that! Oh my gosh. Oh, did y'all see how I was holding the pole? <laughs> hey, that ACC crappie sticks does some work for you guys. It'll work for you. All right, look at that. What a pretty fish. These are females. I don't think I've caught one male yet. See guys, look. I don't know if y'all can see this, but there's a, a log right here and it's going down into the water i can't see where the base is but that is structured just because it's not over here with the big pile of uh, the the log jam right here just because you can't see it does not mean there's not fish on it so i'm just kind of eyeballing it on where i think the end of that tree is and i'm just dropping down and i'm just jigging down beside it uh-oh the wind stopped blowing for a second. Let's see if I can get some of these other spots. Oh, that's juicy over there. Gotta be a fish. Dang, is it that deep right there? Oh my gosh, look at that. Oh, gotta be a fish, baby. Look at that. I knew there was a fish in there. The wind blowing, the wind stopped blowing just long enough for me to pull this tank out. That's what I'm talking about. Let's go. I'm telling you guys, see, there's a little hole right over there. I don't think I can get back over there as of right now, but I let it sit in there. And actually, I, guys, look, I caught that about, shoot 
five to six foot deep, honestly. A little deeper than what I had been catching them. Oh, you got to love just going right in the thick of it. I mean, that stuff is so thick right there. Oh my gosh, let's see if there's one in there. There he is. Get out of there. That's what I'm talking about. Let's go. Right in the thick of the junk. Look at that. I'm telling you guys, hey, this chartreuse and uh, monkey milk body and chartreuse tail, it is doing some work for me ever since I changed. Nope. Well, that's what I get. We, they're feisty guys they're feisty look at that fish guys i mean that is a nice fish let's go that cooler is filling up and we're still pulling them out baby we're still pulling them out let's see if there's another one There he is. Oh my gosh, that is a toad. That is a toad. Oh, let's go. Guys, I literally just dropped back down in there. Seriously. Oh my gosh. Man, this is so fun right here, guys. Never had a video actually doing this type, but this right here is fun. Now, hey guys, this works the same way with bridges, okay? Just because this is a railroad trestle, it's the same thing as a bridge, okay? You find those creeks on the northern side of the lakes and you find the, the bridge where the creek goes under or whatever, those log jams that get caught by the bridge pillars, this is the same scenario right here except it's just a railroad trestle they're there guys go get them all right guys i got the chest mount on now give y'all a little different angle that head mount can be really tricky as far as um how the fish look to me the fish don't look that big on a on the head mount i guess it's the oh my gosh Oh, that's a toad. Guys, if that's not pushing two pounds, I don't know, guys. That may be pushing two pounds. Seriously, let's weigh it. This is the first one I've caught that I seriously think may be pushing two pounds. I mean, that is a stud. That is a stud fish. Let's see here. I got my scale. Where's it? At? Right here. Let's see, guys. Clamp that on there. Hey, that's a that's a one six one six five right there. Over a pound and a half fish course somebody's calling me while i'm filming all right guys i need four more fish for a limit believe it or not four more i mean these are just stacked up fish of course the wind is killing me right now Oh my gosh. Oh my God, they're getting bigger. Guys, y'all see that toad? That is a donk. That's the biggest one of the day so far. That might be two pounds. May Guys, I'm serious. That, if that's not a, two, that's, that's a one eight, I'm calling it. One eight, I'm calling it. One eight, baby. 
let's see here. Look at that fish. Look at that fish, guys. Oh my gosh. I'm calling it 1.8. That's heavier than the last one. It's got to be. No way. No way. Another 1.63. Hmm. I think my scale is broken. There it is. There he is. Oh my gosh. No, 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 no. Don't do it. Don't do it. Don't do it. Guys, look at this hoss. Oh my gosh. You know what? I'm going to boat flip him. We're going to boat flip him today. Ah. Oh my lord. Guys, that is a freaking take. Oh. That's got to be another one six then, if not bigger. Oh my gosh. Look at that fish. Ooh wee. What a stud. Well, that's a female, but you know what I mean. Oh man. Nice fish, guys. Oh man, let's go. May have to move and catch these last two. There he is. He hit it on the fault. Right there. That's what I'm talking about. Look at there. Oh, guys, that's number 24. I am one away from a one man limit. Let's get it. I am one away from a one man limit. That's a good fish. Let's get it. That's 24 right there. Let's see if I can get it real quick. 25. Oh, 25. No, he's got me hung up. Ah, he's on. I got him. I got him. No. 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 That's why I wanted to be over there. God, that sucker pulled and pulled. I, I can't reach. I know there's fish over there, too. Golly. I know there is. Can't reach. Let me see if I can get him. I can't reach it from here. You know what? I can go in this little hole, though. It's my little hole right here. Let's see if I can pull one out. There he is. Oh, no, really? Now he's on. He's on. Here, got him. I got him. Look at there. He's wrapped around the whole pillar. You know what? That ACC does not care. Look at there. That ACC don't care. Guys, that's 25. That's a one-man limit right there. That is 25 fish. Man. How fun is that? How fun is that, guys? I'm out here in the little John boat. No electronics. Guys, you can do this too, all right? If I can do it, then you can do it too as well. You don't need all the fancy equipment to catch fish. I'm telling you. I show you all that on a regular basis on this channel, and it is amazing. All right, guys. I am back at the truck, and look at this haul of fish, guys. We're talking 25 nice crappie i don't think there's one crappie here that's under a pound and a half i mean seriously all of these crappie all of these crappie are a pound and a half bigger guys every single one we're talking about a great time out here today i found a little log jam by the railroad trestle and that is where i caught all of my fish today and i was really surprised guys i didn't expect these crappie to be I expected to catch a few, but I didn't expect them to be stacked up like this. Y'all already know I use my 11 foot ACC crappie sticks today. Y'all need to be sure to go get you an ACC crappie sticks at accrappiesticks.com. I also caught all my fish on Dead River baits. Now guys, let me tell you something about Dead River baits real quick. 
Jesse is so backed up in orders. He is only taking orders on Fridays right now. Okay, so if you ask anybody that I know that have purchased Dead River Baits, you're not going to regret it. The wait is definitely worth it. I apologize for the long wait times. Jesse is a one-man show over there, and he's doing the best he can to get all of those orders out. So y'all be patient with him. You can use promo code 903 to get your 15% off your entire order at DeadRiverBaits.com. Y'all be sure to go check him out. Like I was saying in the video, you can catch these crappie as well. Go to these creeks and small rivers off the northern edge of your main lake and look for structure. In a foot to five feet of water, that is primarily where these crappie are gonna try to spawn at. And remember, they love structure, whether they're in 30 foot of water or if they're in 12 inches of water. Crappie love to feel protected, and I found that log jam. They're spawning near that log jam. My bass tracker is in the shop right now. Matt has it over at In-N-Out Power Sports. He's putting me some new carpet on there right now and fixing a couple other little issues, but I can't wait to get that out of the shop. It's gonna be great. Y'all be sure to hit up Matt. His information is also gonna be in the description of this video, whether you need cosmetic work, mechanical work, in installation with uh, your electronics, it doesn't really matter. Matt over at In-N-Out Power Sports, he can do it all. I don't know when this video is gonna be dropping, but I'm gonna be giving away an eight foot ACC crappie stick super grip when we hit 20,000 subscribers on the channel, guys. 20,000 subscribers equals, I'm gonna give away an eight foot ACC crappie stick super grip on a live show. Don't forget, channel memberships are now available. All you gotta do is hit that blue little join button pick your tier and there's going to be some perks to go along with that tier guys so don't forget to become a channel member today also 903 fishing merch is now available 903fishing.trifinds.com both of those links will be in the description of this video thank y'all so much for being a part of the 903 fishing family i greatly appreciate it guys if you're already subscribed god bless you you know i would not be doing this without you guys if you haven't hit that subscribe button and you love you some crappie fishing whether it be from the boat bank or kayak y'all be sure to come join the family you will not regret it like always like comment and subscribe to 903 fishing y'all have a great day god bless